Hello, my name is Orlando Torricella from thinkastorricella.com. Well, this video is especially aimed at buyers, but also at sellers, so that they know the processes that are important when selling a property with a sales contract with a deposit or earnest money. It is important for you, as a buyer, to know that you must be clear about whether you are solvent enough to buy a property in order to know the price of the property before you put money into the deposit contract. Para el precio del inmueble, antes de que pongas dinero en el contrato de arras. Hemos visto muchos... We have seen many deposit contracts that do not include the clause stating that if the bank does not give them the loan, they will return the deposit. Si el banco no les da el préstamo, les devuelven la señal o arras. Entonces, esto... So, this is very important for you to know before signing the contract, if a bank is going to give it to you or not, if you can make an offer in which they ask for a deposit. O no. Si puedes hacer una eh, oferta en la que te pidan un depósito, pero claro, si no... Te... But, of course, if the bank doesn't give it to you, they would have to return it to you. So, it is very important, first of all, before even starting to look at homes, that you know what your solvency is. To do this, you just have to go to a bank. You do not need to have the exact address of the home or the house you want to buy. La vivienda, ni la casa incluso que quieras comprar. Tienes que saber el... You have to know the price you are getting. Eh, para eso, es el... That's what I'm telling you. Banco directamente. You go directly to a bank with your financial information at the bank or give you a personalized simulation, a personalized loan proposal. Personalizada before giving you the standard European information sheet. You will be given it for free, so that you know the approximate price you will be paying. And so, when you go looking for homes, you already know, approximately, the price you will end up with. And you will fall into the hands of real agencies, who will only shoot your property that they sometimes let you all fire. A sabienda, saben que no vas a poder comprarla, no van a pedirte... They are not going to ask you if you are solvent or not, and what they are going to do is quickly ask you for a reservation or deposit, to make a contract, rushing you. But there are more customers, that there are more buyers, etc. And then, if they have not included this clause that we are discussing, that if a bank does not give you the loan, because it does not give you the appraisal, for whatever reason, it must cancel the contract and return a deposit or reservation. Reserva. This, buyer, is important for you to know to avoid real estate agencies keeping your deposit. Que haya inmobiliarias que se queden con tu señal y para que tengas... And so that you have much more precision and freedom when searching for and choosing a house that you can actually buy, avoiding disappointments and wasting time. Una casa que realmente puedas comprar evitando disgustos y evitando pérdidas de tiempo. Same for sellers. Sellers who know that it is important for a buyer to be solvent. Because if they go and sign a deposit contract and the buyer is not solvent and then the bank does not give it to them, then they have been a month, two months, or whatever was stipulated in the contract, wasting time without being able to sell that property. So, if you have any questions about contracts or about this solvency issue, please contact us and we will be happy to try to help you on WhatsApp 693-023926 with more than 34 if you call or contact from outside Spain. Greetings Orlando Torricilla. Until the next videos, God willing.